My first question might not be the easiest for a politician to answer, but this is Rebel News, and I'm Drea Humphrey. Thanks for having me. Thank you. In 2021, the Tecumseh Te Shwetmik First Nation Band government said that they found the remains of 215 children who were former students of the former Kamloops Indian Residential School. The reality is that to date, not a single body has been discovered. The band government itself has revised the wording of their claim to say that it's 200 probable graves, no mention of specific children anymore. And the only way to know what's actually beneath the soil would be to excavate, which the band government has not done in two and a half years to date. Meanwhile, in Canada, 96 churches have been burnt or vandalized across the country since that initial claim was made. Many of the fires are proven arsons, and the vandals often leave messages that tie to the initial 215 kids claim buried in unmarked graves. My question is, why, just like the leftist media, the NDP, the Liberal government, are the Conservatives also so quiet about this truth and good news which is that to date 215 children's remains have not been discovered there. When that truth coming from political leaders could potentially help set free Christian Canadians from attacks on their places of worship. Thank you for your question. I would disentangle two parts because there is no justification for burning down a church, period. Uh, regardless of the other information or uh, regardless of the other justifications that people would claim to, to use, there is never a justification to burn down a church. And we as Conservatives have called for stronger criminal sanctions for arson against all who carry out these attacks. We've also called for more security infrastructure around places of worship so that we can stop terrorists who burn down churches, who attack mosques and synagogues. Unfortunately, these crimes against religious communities have raged out of control after eight years of Justin Trudeau's catch and release system, after he has divided our country and turned people and groups against each other. We have more violence directed against religious uh, groups, including Christians, uh, than we have ever seen in Canadian history. This is the result of Justin Trudeau. He is not worth the cost, he is not worth the crime, and he is not worth the country that we know and love. And we should provide the resources to allow for full investigation into uh, the uh, uh, potential remains at, at uh, residential schools. Uh, Canadians uh, deserve to know the truth, and uh, Conservatives will always stand in favour of historical accuracy. Uh, none of this changes the fact that the residential schools were an appalling uh, abuse of power by the state and by the, the, the church at the time. Uh, and we need to move forward in a country that is free so that every single Canadian, uh, whether their ancestry goes back tens of thousands of years or whether they have been here for 10 days, uh, has the freedom to live their life and, and in prosperity and uh, happiness. Thank you.